Hi guys, welcome back to my Horizon Zero Dawn, the DLC into the Frozen Wilds. Alright, so here's the map. It's this little piece right here. We have to explore. Still need stuff to do over here. <laughs> So it's basically a side class. Yeah, right there. You gotta talk to some dude. And he gives you the side class. Alright, let's do this. Let's follow the blue lights. So pretty. Oh, guess we gotta go that way. What are you doing, Aloy? This path leads to the cut. You have nothing to offer besides useless mysticism. The Eclipse won't stand idle while you waste time playing in the snow. Return to your desk. Surprised you're still checking up on me. I thought you had moved on. Well, forgive me for still being concerned with the fate of the world. I was thinking. Oh. Rost used to tell me stories about the Banuk and their shamans, and how they thread blue cables through their skin. Kind of like someone else we know, huh? So maybe the real reason you want me to stay clear of the Banuk is to stay clear of your past. It's not the past that concerns me, Eloy. It's the future. Or possible lack thereof. Which is why you should stop prattling and get back to what matters. But as usual, <laughs> you'll do as you wish. Mm. Touchy. But I just finished that mission. What are you talking about? I just completed the game, too. <laughs> I want to fight Hades again. <laughs> it's kind of weird. You still complete the game. Uh, it's still there, you see? So I don't know. <laughs> I think the game's glitched or something. Falling around, around. To us, we're told, baby. Ooh, that's a first. This one's a new predator. I can see the heat coming off it. Uh, since I was there, let's use that. Should we take it down? Right on the right side. I don't know. Wow.
What does he got? Ah, let's go have something new. Oh, I forgot to scan it. So the fire is the new thing. So that's a different path. Basically, it's just saying why you noise. And one of these. And one of these, she said. <laughs> Pretty light. Okay, that's a welcome, I guess. Nora, I've worked up a sweat from the climb. Well, hello there, lady. Oops, wrong way. Can't enter this location. Wait, what? Not that you'll stay long. This is Song's Edge, biggest settlement in the cut. Man, this arrow does a lot of damage. Smoke rising from the mountain. And the village, too. What's it for? The new soldier. Made it. Hey. How are we to trust <gasps> the chief after so many died under his command? Our shaman has abandoned us. Our chieftain has led our best to this. I forgot to do something too. Uh, oh, no. <laughs> right this. The Fennec figure. Yeah, that's something new from the DLC. Oh, that was just right there. Good gunning. Oh, well. <laughs> Must be 
there's something big going on. Most of the village is moving towards that smoke. I wonder if there's new outfits. I do. Do a manual save. Ready for a rare sight, Nora. Bergrin, purveyor of necessities. Most of the time, the Banuk burn their dead. But not today. Because the bodies couldn't be recovered. Aye, a nasty business. All their best warriors lost. So they're getting a different kind of send-off. Grasp your grief, my hunters, and kill it! For our kin seize the fate all Banuk long for. Falling with their spears striking steel. Their struggle is over now. You have witnessed their spirits rise up into the blue sky and beyond to the blue light. But our struggle is only beginning. Soon, we will again take up the hunt against the daemon that frenzies the machines against us. And so I ask you, can you summon the courage of our fallen kin? Will you fight and die as well as they did? My courage, my spear! Blood is in your teeth, Oratok! We are Banuk. Our enemies. Our prey. The daemon. That frenzies the machines. Machines that wiped out their best. And what do they want to do? Go back up there. Fools. A little advice, uh, for free. Uh... Aloy. Aloy. I've been up here for two long winters, and I still can't make sense of the Banuk. Take this ruckus. It started with one of their shamans, uh, Orea, spouting on about spirits and daemons up on Thunder's drum. So they march their Warwick up there, and half of them get slaughtered by machines. When Aria vanished, I thought the crazy might have gone with her. But no. Here's Big Aritok, gearing them up to do it all over again. The 
Banuk. What is it about the Banuk you can't make sense of? Mm. Well, everything's a test to them. A hardship to endure. A challenge to survive. Seems like they don't have much of a choice in a place like this. Yeah. A land cold enough to crack teeth. Filled with wild animals. You'd think they'd accept a little reasonably priced aid. Well, believe me, I've tried to convince them. But a Banuk with nothing left to prove might just lie down and die. And Orea is the one who spoke about this daemon? That's right. Told Aratak and the others that it lives up on Thunder's Drum. And they believed him. But you don't. <laughs> Look, I don't know what Orea found up there. A shaman's not gonna talk to an outlander. The machines in the cut are getting more vicious, that's a fact. It could be because of the daemon. Or it could be because they all got indigestion, for all I know. But Araya's not around to explain. She took off, and no one knows why. Is Aratak a renowned warrior around here? He's a Warwick chieftain. His voice carries a lot of respect. Not that you hear much of it. Man talks about as much as a dead fish. But when he and Araya came to town with their Warwick, it drew more Banuk to this little bird than I'd ever seen. Know what else I saw, Aloy? My own little trade route, stretching all the way back to the claim. Then, he goes and leads them off to their death at the claws of angry machines. Uh, so much for my best customers. What are these Werricks about, Burgrind? Some sort of tribe within the tribe? Eh, not like our clans back home. You don't get born into these things. They hold tryouts. Prove your best at something, and you might get a place. Somewhere it's come and go. Some last as long as metal. The whole Banuk territory, Banur, is just a bunch of the biggest, oldest Wericks. I'm not sure if I'm less confused or more confused. <laughs> well, here's the sure thing. Each Werick has a chieftain and a shaman. They make the decisions. All well and good, except the chieftains are hard-headed, and the shamans have their heads in the clouds. You said you've lived out here for two winters? Aye. Back home, some fur traders told me about this steel-forsaken heap of tents. Good location. Ripe for change. We were barely scraping by until this place started filling up for Araya. A great prophet is coming, they said. Ah, oh, I heard prophet. Honest mistake. Not that the Banook are stingy, they just prefer to keep trade among themselves. We could get through to enough of them. We could really put this place on the map. Or at least on a map. We? Me and my daughter. Mm, my assistant. Barger, my assistant and my daughter. We seem to get along better as business partners. Her mother wanted me to show her a trade. She started tinkering with weapons. Say, when you need a break from this Banuk carry-on, stop in and see her. You're both, uh, mm, how do I put it? Uh, Women? No, 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 I independent. Look for her at Long Night. The easternmost Banuk camp. Have you ever heard of a man named Silence? Tall, deadly serious, cables in his skin? Like a shaman? Mm. I've heard that name once or twice, but always whispered. Like some boogeyman the Banuk want to forget. I'm not sure what went down, but I got the impression he messed with the Conclave. Or they messed with him. Conclave. All the most important shamans gather in Banur from time to time to keep up with the latest mumbo jumbo. No idea how they all fit into one tent without those crazy headdresses getting locked up on each other. Araya's been to that shindig, but when I asked her what it's like, she just gave me a dirty look. So if you want to know more, you'll have to find her and make her like you, I guess. Good luck. I want to know more about this daemon. Mm -mm. It's crazy talk, Aloy. Or there's something to it. Something connected to how the machines behave. Then you need to find Aurea. 
She was last seen headed for the mountains they call the Ice Rafts. I've heard only the shamans know the trail beyond those frozen peaks. Mm. But I do know where you could find her apprentice, Naltuk. He went north of the river, chasing rumors. Rumors? Not the good kind. Sudden attacks in the snow. Strange new structures. Some say a new machine, like no one seen before. Well, now I'm definitely interested. Thanks for the talk, Burgund. Don't mention it. I wonder if Aratok can tell me more about Araya or Thunder's Drum. Might be worth a shot. Even if I cared to travel south, I'd not get much further. You seem sad, stranger. I heard you mention a flood? Yes. A sudden deluge, without rain or melt to explain it. I'm Lao Lai, the drummer of Deep Din. Or at least I was, until it disappeared under the waters. Deep Din? What's that? A hollow, carved out by the old ones. A chamber, a basin, and a musical instrument all at once. My life, my calling. I'd explain it by playing for you if I could, but its pipes are deep under the water now. So Deep Din is a place, and a musical instrument? Yes. Pipes that carry a perfect tone beneath a sonorous basin. A wondrous edifice the old ones used to carry music far and wide. During the war, my father played the pipes to rally the Banuk against the Karja. I'm the drummer now, but our battles are few and far between. Mostly I play for the joy of it, or to remember my family. Of course, if the waters don't recede, what's the point of joy or remembering? So the waters came fast. One day it was dry. The next the nearby river had risen and the entire basin was flooded. I don't understand it. There was no rain, not even any clouds, and yet the river rose higher than I'd ever seen it. And there it remains. A flood without rain. That is strange. Where is this place? I'll have a look if I'm in the area. Just northwest of here. Look all you like, but I don't see what good it'll do. The floodwaters aren't going anywhere. How does one ask a river to relent? Water log. Where's that at? Yeah. It's not that far from here. Let's see what he got. Hope Blue Glam. That's new. Fourteen sixteen. Outfits. Ooh. <gasps> Ooh, like that one. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Let's get that. I do not want to hear this talk from you again. 
Doubt is heavier than a week's snow. Forgive me, my chieftain. We will be ready for the next attempt. But this will not be an attempt. It must be done. Do you understand? My chieftain. Good. Outlander, I suppose you wish to speak? Aurea knows about this, Damon. Where would I talk to her? She does a shaman's work. That is not for the eyes and ears of others. Certainly not in Outlanders. There are other Werax in Song's Edge, too? Yes. The village has its own life for all Banuku who need trade or shelter. After the war ended, it sprang up from what was once a campsite, quick as the bloom between frosts. Perhaps it will last until the Karja seek war again. He sounds like Ross. <laughs> Did your Warwick come from this place? No, he rallied most of our hunters from across Banyur to face the threat of the demon. But I was born here and stayed to fight the Karja when others retreated into the mountains. A few of my old warriors remain with me, those who survived. The expedition of Thunderstrong. You're set on going back to the mountain? I put my word to it. Even with the risks being so great? The risk of what? Death? It would be a worse fate to bow our heads to the challenge and say too much. Farewell, well, I guess my that's friend. it then. Good. I prefer deeds to words. Right. Me. Okay, if I want to learn more about how this demon That's affects another the machines, shape, please. I've got to find Aurea. To do that, I need to talk to Outlander. Outlander. Wait, wait, wait a moment. River north. <laughs> that weapon of yours, Outlander, that spear, I can see the blue light upon it. This? It was made by an acquaintance of mine. Ah, a shaman. Uh, no. More of a tinker? A tinker does not understand the spark in the metal, the song in the metal like this. But it could be improved upon, modified with the help of the old ones. Far north of here, there is a cave, a shaft in the snow. Within it is a nest of metal birds. Find a bird that hasn't been stripped by shaman's past. Look for a rail inside it, the length of your spear. That's all I can tell you. Get a rail from some metal birds in a cave. Sounds perfectly normal. Stone you has always been. And he's been. Oh, that's an area. If we must face stronger machines. We'll have to become better. Any news from the hunt? The herd is at roaming far. But I'm set to destroy. Sorry. We meet. <laughs> Something. Oh, it's a watcher. He's watching me. No, it's dead. <laughs> Three metal shorts.
craft more uh, fire arrows. Knock one of those over. They're about to last. Where is it? Where did you saw that? Oh, it's this way. Tony. There's some uh, demonic. Um, Everything's freezing. The ground, the air, me. Everything's frozen. It's been a long time ago. But the scavengers have just gotten oh, started. Goats. See how deep the damage goes. The Vanuk were protecting it. This tall neck was probably holy to them. Oh, they grabbed that one. Gotta make more spikes. Uh, let's get rid of that one. And let's take that one. Could be something We're around that my focus will see. Really? It looks like the scavengers ripped out three major parts. If I could bring them back, maybe I could even reactivate it. Get it what's inside its head. 
Oh, that's why you can't see it. Oh, we gotta find the parts. Right into life. Right into life. <coughs> oh, shit. Oh. I just wasted that. Can I... Party little plant. You'll help. Now that the manic scraper. Did I say scraper?
fire don't work. Never know when I might need these. Oh, come on, leave me alone. Whatever you are. You got it.
really something They're scanning for me. It's in better shape than it was. All right, where's the other one? <laughs> okay, I'm right. You just need to get the power flowing through it again. And if I'm wrong, I have least no one's watching. Sticky forever. <laughs> Perhaps my focus Stop can help me. Stop talking to them. Come on, let's go.
Maybe my focus will see something. If I can't find something, maybe my focus can. Made it. Now to climb up to its head. Bergen said a way as a princess went north of the river. There's another row in here. What the are those things? There's one here too. Let's go to a bit save. Alright guys, gonna end the video here. Thanks for watching. Bye!